uh, I get some questions from some students who already practiced the search level of ZYQ. So the question is yeah, about the pulse state. Yeah, it is difficult to understand and to reach the pulse state, especially during this pulse state to activate our senses. Yeah, so uh, maybe it's really better before the third level, we already have some knowledge about the pulse state, about the senses, how the senses connect with the pulse state. Yeah, certainly everybody want to activate your senses to have the third eye, especially can use the third eye to help us in our life. Really, some people practice even more than 20 years. They yeah, still have, you know, struggle, still struggles for third eye. Yeah, so how's, yeah, how can we activate our third eye? So in, this in general is the some contents in our third level. And in this seminar, I'm going to use some new technology to help to help you to activate your third eye. Okay, now let's see what is the third eye. What we call it third eye. We can easily understand in this way. Yeah, our regular eyes see light different kind of colors. Yeah, this is visible light. Third eye also sees the light, but it's not the light we call it visible. Yeah, it is that light uh, is similar like what we see with our regular light. There are colors, uh, some, light stronger, some light weaker, is similar with different forms can be. Okay, now let's see. So this is here is called pineal gland, pineal gland. This is like the real physical organ about that eye. But exactly what I feel, it's like the whole area is not only this pineal gland, all this connect with our invisible sensitivity. Our regular eye takes the light, receives the light, yeah. and through the nerve system, Go, uh, go into our brains, so our brains will manage it, process it, and understand it. About the third eye, what we see the third eye, it can be much, much higher frequency. It is not regular visible light. It is uh, visible light, as we know, from 400 to 700, uh, and M, but that is very low. For the third eye, probably the frequency will be very, very high. And the wave lungs much, much shorter. If the wave's lungs very, very short, then it can we can understand that is the similar like light. We also can say that is particles, but much smaller than, than the uh, light particle is con quantum. Yeah. So different organs. Our regular eye sees regular light. And the third eye, we call this pineal gland there, that deal with much high frequency information and then change into light also. 
what's the relationship, the pulse state, the pulse state of our mind connect with the pineal gland? So my feeling is, our, when our mind is busy, we are seeing something, it seems this pineal gland have no ability, uh, switched off, cannot receive information. Or when we are thinking the brain active, so even the pineal gland still receives the information, but the brain cannot process it. When our brain stop thinking, even very short time, and then it gave the abilities for the brain to process information from pineal gland. So it seems our brain somehow can, it looks like switch on, switch off, switch on, switch off about processing pineal gland information. Okay, and then we want to know how about the, the pulse state. What is pulse state? Yeah, even some uh, third level practitioners and said, you know, it seems we really reached the pulse state, but not a long time. Yeah, I ask, what did you feel? They felt, you know, I really felt I'm so quiet. I, my body doesn't move. Yeah, my breath seems stopped. And then I start to sink again. Right, that is very yeah, near the pulse state. Here is very interesting. Yeah, some people naturally reached this state. Even that is not professional practice, just naturally reached there. Pulse state in ZYQ, we say that is a state, yeah, real pulse state, is a state at that moment, lungs stop working, no breathe, heart, stop beating, but the chi in the body is much friendly flowing. Yeah, this is the real pulse state. Heart, no beating, lungs, no breathing, and you don't move, physical state. This show you are in the pulse. If, if you can keep in this pulse state for a few minutes, and then you will experience separation, you and the body. Yeah, this is really difficult to reach, to reach this level. Why? Yeah, so in this seminar, uh, we will discuss much, much more here because our chi not strong enough. At this moment, if your internal chi is strong enough, and then your chi will push you out, let you and the body separate from the body. Go out from the body is very difficult, but come in is very easy. So to learn how to back, even we don't learn, you want to back and then you back. But go out, we have to overcome low energy problem. The most important, we have to strengthen our chi. That's like the second level. We need to change chi into shen. Yeah. Change chi into shen also means your chi is level much higher. So we still have some time and who are going to participate 
participate in the search level, you have to practice more search level at mid Dantian and ref, yeah, change Qi into Shen here, practice longer time. Before the pulse state, when we are close to the pulse state in that way, uh, you feel your body is quiet, you don't want to move. It seems your mind somewhere very concentrated or focused on something. And, but you still know you are somewhere, you, are, you can feel, you can listen, but you are deep quiet. You, yeah, you stay somewhere, even you hear around a few, somebody's talking, but you feel you also, uh, you are in another location. You see something in another place, seems you are there. Yeah, this is consciousness separate from physical body. Yeah, this is also very interesting. Why? It is not self. It is consciousness or mind. Mind can separate from physical body. When, when the mind go out, we feel it's go out, but not really go out. Like the camera, camera, you feel yeah, it's very close to you, the sense is very close to you. It seems you are there, but you still in the physical body. Even for example, you feel like sometimes when I do something, I know I'm still standing here. I hear people is talking and they are standing beside me, but also it seems I'm on the sky, from sky to sea, ocean, mountains, even somewhere else. But, you know, it's like consciousness there, sense is there, but sense is also here. Yeah, this kind of abilities, much easier practitioners can get it. Yeah, these abilities is like your mind somewhere and mind can communicate with the body and the mind can see, can hear another location from another location. So that's again, that is again the function at the same time. Yeah, the brain Few ways the senses of the body working, but very light. And pineal gland at same time is working. But pineal gland working together with the consciousness. The consciousness you let you feel you are in another location. In this state, you still feel the physical body. In the real post state, you don't feel the physical body. So these two states, yeah, both uh, one is the real post state, another is close to post state. Both are close to the post state. And we see it's close when you are close to the post state your senses changed. Not only your visible, your reg regular eye can, your regular senses working, also your uh, extra senses, like third eye, third ears. Now all over the world, there are more and more Children yeah, try to understand, not try to tell, not try express their ideas about other world, about what we call extra senses or transportations, etc. Especially now, it seems UFO. Is not a secret. 
there are more and more vision or proof about UFO, about other beings, even higher intellectual beings. And also more and more people meditate in order to upgrade the spiritual level. Another good phenomenon is the scientist always say now technology is developing so quick. Probably from technology's point of view, it will let people believe there are other parallel worlds. There are dark energy, dark substances, dark matters. I think most impressed to people is if we find in the universe, if we can prove in the universe, there are higher intellectual beings than human being, the earth, even the universe, that will be much impressive for us. Even we don't want to believe there are higher beings, higher civilization beings in the universe, but human beings are looking for, are searching in the universe, the higher being or other kind of lives. But anyway, with the Qigong, they were Qigong lineage. We definitely had this knowledge. Even only ancient time with meditation, we can upgrade our level of civilization. Yeah, that is, we will upgrade our civilization from this level with the body, energy, and our information upgrade to energy body, not this, or higher frequency body, to live in higher dimension. That is, we can say, that is a higher civilization, people, human being, definitely will go further to reach this civilization. This civilization, not only realized by people, but also not only by meditation, but also by new technology. So in the near future, it will be the meditation knowledge about this kind of spiritual knowledge combined with dark technology or new technology, especially in the quantum mechanics field. Yeah, because yes, there, the quantum mechanics field, it seems they explore more phenomena which similar like in the spiritual field. Why people believe quantum physics are difficult to believe spiritual phenomenon. Even we know on the earth, there are only some very a few scientists understand the quantum physics, but still people believe in them. Also on the earth, there are a few, not too much spiritual masters. They tell the knowledge, they experience, but it's not so easy to let people to believe. Why? Yeah, easy. If we tell the truth, fact that is easy to understand. So quantum physics, yeah, mechanics, they still let us to believe 
this theory, this theory, this equipment, not the professors. But in the spiritual level, it seems you are not believe this senses, but you seem you believe in the masters, the spiritual teachers. So one is person, another is mass. If we combine, if we combine these together, scientists and spiritual practitioners into one and to help each other and to realize some new technology to help practitioners to reach the higher level and to help scientists to get the black, the dark technology or new technology and to help the whole human beings upgrade their civilizations and then no obstacles exist. For practitioners, we need to train our mind to reach the pulse state. In this pulse state, it again let us manage our mind, or, or, or we say switch on pineal gland, switch off pineal gland, let us to receive and explain the information, invisible information. Okay, so now we meditate a little while, otherwise we're only talking. How we need to manage our mind in order to reach the pulse state early, easier. Concentration. Concentration, you know, some people cannot concentrate because there are uh, Several thoughts, yeah, always appears. This thought, this thought, this thought. You cannot stop thinking. Yeah, this is a real problem for most people. I cannot concentrate. Okay, so here, nobody at beginning can concentrate. This is a procedure. If you really understand and feel, wow, this is right. And then to meditate become the most important event for you in your life. Your brain will become quiet. If in your life the meditation is behind five events, you can, uh, oh, yeah, I have time I do it and no time I not do it. Yeah, this is just for improving health. You will not really get deep, so deep. So the easy way, you just prepare time, do it. Yeah, for example, now we put hands on the middle of the antenna, then the thumb connect to each other and visualize the mid dantian so it seems you are looking at yourself in mid dantian okay close your eye visualize the mid dantian it seems you are in mid dantian this is from the second level
Okay, that's all for today. Have a good night. Bye.